Hello, undergraduate students at Antioch. I'm Dawn Murray, the chair of the Undergraduate Studies Program. And before next quarter starts, I wanted to give you a few tips on using Zoom. You know on the syllabi, we have a statement about mindfulness. And it reads, students are expected to attend every class session prepared to discuss assigned readings and any other completed assignments. Students are expected to actively contribute to discussions as well as being respectful listeners. One way to demonstrate respectful listening is to give the speaker your full attention. And this means turning off all electronic devices unless there is a compelling reason to be using them in class. And this goes double for when your classmates or class visitors are talking or presenting. So some tips for Zoom are very similar to that. When you log in for a class, you need to act as if you're in class because you are in class. So you wanna get ready before you log in. So that means getting dressed, something nice on, get your drink, maybe you need some water, go to the restroom, stretch a little bit and be ready when you log in to be participating in class. Try to go to a quiet room when you start, maybe there's a background or a wall behind you so you can have some privacy. I live in a small apartment with my two teenagers, so um, this is extraordinary circumstances. I am in my bedroom working right now. You can kind of see there's a bathroom behind me. It's not perfect. Uh, I don't even have a desk, so I have this little table that I made. But I'm getting work done. So find yourself a little nook, a little space. It's not gonna be perfect, like I said, but do your very best to create it. Um, and tell people in the house that you're gonna be on a Zoom call for a little bit. So please don't come in if that's possible. And never be on Zoom when you're driving. It's not safe and you can't focus on your learning. So please don't be driving on Zoom when you're in a class. Also, always put yourself on mute when you're not talking. There's a lot of background noise. Who knew my gardeners came every Thursday to the complex and blew really, really loudly. So put yourself on mute so everybody doesn't have to hear everything going on behind you. Also, show yourself on video. Better to be showing yourself so you're really participating in the class as opposed to having a video image, excuse me, as opposed to having an image or just your name pop up. But with your name, be sure your name is showing up under your picture so people can see who you are and get to know you easier. And there's a couple buttons on, on Zoom that you can push to um, make sure your name is showing up. Also, Use the raise hand function so that your instructor knows that you have a question or you wanna say something. That's a button that will show up on the bottom of your screen under participants or more, depending on how small your screen is. And there'll be a little hand up button. So you can raise your hand, then you can put your hand down once you're called on. When you're gonna chat, make sure you chat with everyone and don't privately chat between people. And also have your cell phone on mute, upside down somewhere far away from you so you're not distracted and it doesn't distract the class. So again, we're gonna do everything pretending like you're in class. So get ready when you log in, quiet room, never be on Zoom when you're driving, put yourself on mute when you're not talking, please show yourself on video, if you need to excuse yourself, there's a little button that you can push for like coffee break, but your teachers will be giving you breaks for that. And be sure your name is showing up. Tell people in your house that you're gonna be in class and that you're focusing and use the raise your hand function. Are you excited? Let's get ready. Can't wait to see you on Zoom.